Hi, my name's Penny Power and it is my greatest pleasure to introduce you all and hopefully get you very involved in business blondes. And I'm here with four of us blondes and my lovely job, first of all, is to introduce these incredible ladies. We're one by one going to do that. Then we're going to explain why we're doing Business Blondes TV. And so I'm going to start off by explaining that we all met through a mastermind and we got to know each other and really fell in love with one another for the realness that we had around our lives and our business and the openness that we all shared. And that's what we want to bring to you. So here we go. I'm going to introduce Sam to you now. Thanks, Penny. I'm so excited about this. This, uh, this concept has been part of our lives for a while now. Um, and I can't stop smiling to do finally get on camera today and introduce ourselves. But my name is Sam, Sam Lindley, and I have been working with SMEs for over 10 years now, mainly in Essex and Suffolk. Um, I've been known and branded as the mother of all masterminds because I just love bringing people together as a mastermind facilitator and watching them grow and develop and support each other with the tenacity and dedication that entrepreneurs have. So I'm really excited to be sharing the journey that I've experienced and everything else that my clients tell me along the way too. So Carol Ann, I've had the pleasure, we've all had the pleasure of knowing you for the last year or so. We know why you're different, but tell our future viewers, Carol Ann, why you're a different coach. Yeah, I am a different coach. In fact, it says on my byline here, thanks, Sam, not just another coach. And the reason I say that is uh, there's a lot of coaches out there and I'm, I'm passionate about helping coaches in business to really have abundant practices. I've been a coach for about 18 years now and it's the most awesome job. You help people reach their private and personal and professional potential. And what, what greater thing is that to really learn to be yourself at, the, at your very best. So I'm really super smile on steroids excited about doing the business blondes because I think together we can support people we can help people starting out in business and uh, also help, I want to particularly help you know put a, a shout out to coaches helping them to get an abundant practice and not just mm -hmm. be paid for friends to make the profession you know really serious a, a career uh, that is that has great gravitas and credibility so I'm just super excited to be here share best practice and be with you all which is a fa fabulous Business Blondes community, which leads me on to another beautiful Business Blonde, uh, the, the gorgeous leadership queen that is Kim Adele. So tell us a bit about yourself. Oh, bless you, Caroline. What, what a lovely intro. I am so excited, and we all know that I am naturally a bit of a hyperactive puppy dog, so I'm going to try and, uh, and not channel my inner puppy. Um, I have I'm so thrilled to be um, part of this group and to be able to share kind of our hints, our tips, our stories. Having spent the last 25 years um, journeying from hairdresser to CEO, there's been lots of um, stories along the way that have really inspired me. And I've been really fortunate to have met some amazing people who have been able to share their stories and share their tips. And it, that's what drives us all forward. It's what enables us all to grow. And on that subject, one of the fabulous people that I actually got to meet and learn their story and be inspired by is the absolutely fabulous Penny Power. So can you tell our viewers about you, please? Mm. Yeah, well, I called myself an accidental entrepreneur for a long while. Some people that are watching Business Blondes will probably find they built a business, but they didn't actually realise what a big job that was going to be. And that happened to me when I became an entrepreneur in 1998. And as some people know, it was through creating the world's first social network. And I learned a very tough journey over 14 years of what scaling a business can be like going global and then the crashing part of my life um, when we had to sell the business and it was painful and it was the loss of um, identity as well as a big financial tumble so like many people here I'm sort of juggling motherhood I've been juggling that and I've got three older children um, I love entrepreneurship but I love the real and rawness of it and I think we're at a time when I think we all need a bit of honesty and truth so that we don't all spend our life on Instagram or Facebook thinking Christ I'm not as good as all the other people so um, I suppose I spend my life trying to be the honest entrepreneur so that we can create a real benchmark of what it's like having an incredible life as a business owner but also understanding that really we don't all find it easy and so that's my story, I suppose. I've been an author a couple of times. Um, I love building community, but most of all, I just love connecting with real people. 
So that is all of us. Now I'm going to ask Sam, why Business Blondes? Why are we doing it? Um, that is such an easy answer. Business Blondes is because, like we've said already in our, in our intro today, we are women that keep it real. So that's what we identified about each other. And I think that's what gravitated us towards each other and us four um, to, to build this platform together. I think we are very grounded coaches. We understand the world of business. We understand the world of relationships. We know how important it is. But most of all, what I've learned through my mastermind journey is that it's the support. It's just talking about real life issues, real life topics and challenges that we all face on a daily basis and supporting each other around that that keeps us as we are and as effective as we are. So that's why I'm excited about doing that with you girls and through, uh, through this platform together. Yeah. Karen, what about you? I think being in business is one of the most awesome adventures you can be on, but it's also a lonely place sometimes. And I think the thing that's uh, significantly over the years built my business was having a community of like-minded people around, whether it was networking groups or, or special groups that just do what you do. And that's what I want with for Business Blondes is to provide that community, that support, that sense of I'm not doing this on my own. Because anyone who has a business, you know those things in nightclubs where they have a little red rope and it's the VIP lounge, and you're not on the guest list. Well, anyone who's got a business, we are in that VIP lounge because we made our dreams a reality, and that's huge. Most people don't. They, they just want a job. They want to do this. But anyone who's got their own business, to me, you're already in the VIP lounge. You're already awesome, and now we're here to support you, inspire, motivate, give you some insider track on what really works, and know that you're always, you've always got someone to turn to for oh, business blondes. <laughs> so, so um, Kim, why did you want to do this? Oh my God, it was such an easy decision for me for all of the reasons that you guys have already talked about. But I think, you know, as, as human beings, we're social animals and we need to be connected. And actually it can be very lonely. It can be very lonely as, a, as an entrepreneur. It can be very lonely as a leader. Um, because, you know, as they say, it's lonely at the top. It's certainly not quiet. Um, and I think sometimes what you need to be able to do is find a space, find somebody who you can talk to whether that's to share a vulnerability or to share a success but just so that you feel that connection and you know i'm a big believer in the fact that we all need our critical best friends that person that is with trust love and honesty tells us our bum looks big in something before we go out not when we've tripped around town all day thinking we look amazing and i think for me that's the beauty of, the, of this group is i've got total and utter trust and support that you guys have got my back and that you'll keep it real and you'll tell me how it is and actually that's what we need and for me that's what I wanted us to be able to bring to the to the wider um, community that we're building so Penny what about you so three years ago I seriously considered whether I wanted to stay in business I think um, I got quite hurt I started to lose um, confidence in myself and I think that's what prompted me to write my book. And it was very honest and it was scary. And I actually had this moment where I thought, I don't know whether this honest view of life is going to mean that I have to step away from business. That maybe some people would say, well, no wonder you found it tough. Look at what a you are, <laughs> what a crazy woman you are. Um, and I really seriously considered retraining and becoming a midwife, which I think would be just gorgeous. <laughs> but I did stay in the business world and I love it now more than ever because of this real feeling that I'm going to be just me, real, raw, as it is. Um, I mean, I think anybody that's seen me speak sees that I do swear a bit, but I'm going to try not to do that on this. <laughs> um, so I just like the thought that when people come onto our show, they're just going to have this realness that, that life is just what it is. You know, men and women, you know, we all know as coaches, we know what's under the bonnet, don't we? Because we are privileged to be able to listen to people and feel that comparison from a real true point of view. And that's what I'm really excited about is just this helping to calm everyone down. So Sam, tell us about how we, how this is going to happen. You know, we, we're going to, we're going to have a show that goes out every week, aren't we? Yes, we are. So we will be launching and the show will be live posted on our website which is www.businessblonde.tv 
you can find us on Twitter, you can find us on Instagram, and you can find us on Facebook at Business Blondes. And we will be launching on September the 10th at 1 p.m. And we'll be doing a show for one hour every Thursday at 1 p.m. And we cannot wait. That's brilliant. And Carol Ann, what's um, what is this sort of culture? What is what is it going to be like for people when they die, when they listen in? I think our core values are keeping it real and raw. I think we're here to support. I think we're here as a community. I think those buzzwords at the moment: we're flexible, we're agile. Uh, we'll have some amazing subjects coming up, and most of all, we're going to be super badass about it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love that. And um, Kim, we've, we've been really brainstorming the topics and um, tell us a bit about what some things people expect. Yeah, so we've got some truly amazing guests lined up as well, both men and women, to help us to really bring to life some of the subjects that are really real for us right now. Things around diversity and inclusion, um, health and well-being, and the business secrets that they just don't share. That's one to definitely dive into. Um, how you survive the despair and compare society within which we live and how you keep your engine running. How do you keep yourself motivated when sometimes you just lost your mojo? Um, are just a few of the fantastic topics that we're going to be talking about. And trust me, the guests are going to blow your mind. Yeah, that is it's so exciting. So we've got this, we've got our social feeds all set up, thanks to the amazing Kim. And we're found on at Business Blondes across all of the, the platforms. We want to hear from people. Um, if people want to be experts, you know, providing they are the sort of person that we want on this. I suppose I'm channeling a bit of the loose women bit here as well in my head. Um, and so um, I guess it's just to leave us to say 10th of September from every Thursday at one o'clock from here on in. Please get involved. And men and women, I know we're all the business blondes, but we're very into the diversity of this in every way. And we just want you to have some fun every Thursday lunchtime with us. So thanks very much for listening to our showreel. And let's see you come on board with us. Bye. See ya. Thank you. Bye.